Hey, Paul. Hi. Welcome to this new episode of Hey, Paul. Thank you, Bill. Happy <laughs> to be here. Paul's here this week. It's the first live edition. First, first uh, live edition. I don't know what we're doing. I don't know why we're doing, but we're here. And we're going to do live videos through the internet, and then we'll upload it to YouTube. That sounds good. So this week, we're going to do Genesee. And I'll bring it close so you all can see it. It's Genesee beer. So our typical first thing we do. Oh, Paul's bringing it too. Yeah. Genesee. 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 Don't let me shake it too much. That's bad. So let's go over the review of the can itself. You can see it is a, a white can. For the most part, there's, it's got a label uh, in Boston that says 1878. So this is an old style beer. It's not a good label if you just saw it on the shelf. I, I'm kind of getting more used to it, you know, so yeah. So we, so when we, we took our trip, we're actually upstate New York right now. We saw that Genesee is a beer we usually don't see on the island, so that's why we purchased it. Uh, all it says is Genesee and beer on it, mm -hmm. and, a, and a year. So, I think it's a what four and a half percent, something about that. Yeah, it sounds right. Four and a half. Yeah, four and a half. So let's give it a pour out. Let's open them up. Oh shit! Oh my god, we almost died. Let's we see. didn't die. You want to do a sip or you want to do a pour first? Uh, we're going to do a pour first. We'll do half, half a right. can. Half a can. All right, get, a, get a little uh, 45 degree angle. That feels like half a can. Take a All look. Right. Take a look at the, the pour itself. You can see uh, most of its head. Yeah. So this, this beer does not accept a very hard pour. So nice I'd, and clear. Yeah, it, it's a clear beer. Very clear beer. Yeah. It's kind of pale. So it almost looks like a light beer. Sure. Uh, I don't see too much carbonation going through it, but also it pours hard, so maybe the carbonation comes right out immediately. So, I don't know. Let's, we can give it a smell. See what happens. Oh, oh. That, that ruins your demeanor. <laughs> <laughs> Drink it through the mask. No, I'm kidding. Uh-oh. <laughs> he wore the I'm mask Wilson. to keep himself hidden. So, a sniff. It smells like a malty beer. It doesn't. Yeah. It's not a. Com it doesn't smell like a complicated beer. It smells like a standard beer that you would drink. Just a lot of malt. And, yeah. Yeah. Maybe like a barley malt. So I'll give it. I'll give it a sip. So the carbonation hits you really first. Very bubbly in the mouth, but after uh, if the bu bubbly goes down, it's all malts. The barley malt. But there's, there's nothing much to this beer. But it's good though. It's 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 not bad. No, it's not a bad beer. It's better than Budweiser. Better than Coors. Yeah. So like, uh, it's like a beer. Like if we were hanging out, like right now, upstate New York, I'd just be pounding these down. Believe it or not, that's what I've been doing all night. And seven dollars for fifteen of them. Yeah, it's it's a good price point just to have beer that you don't care about. Yeah. You know, it's not really something you have to think about. Which you know, it's good. Yeah, I enjoy it. Yeah. So, uh, a refreshing rating? What do you think? I'm thinking like maybe like. It's pretty damn refreshing. It is. Uh, maybe like a seven of nine. Yeah, maybe an eight in my book for refreshing. All right. So just got, because it's just. It's yeah, like it, it was a hot day today upstate. Yeah. Dark. There's it's it's not dark. It's not, it's not it doesn't like it's not like a stout. You know, it's it's. It doesn't catch. Totally it doesn't catch you know? and hold you on the tongue. It just yeah. it just goes through. Mm -hmm. And it's been great. Um, we could taste it right from the can, right? All right? Let's see. Give it a sip, sippy poo. Now, where is it better? Actually, I think it's better from the can. So when we pour it into the glass, it loses a lot of carbonation. When you drink yeah. it right from the can, it keeps a lot of carbonation. And it's colder in the can, too. It's colder just by default. Some beers are weird in the can. This has a good can feel, you know? It's feel. Some of the cans, uh, it's not Tecate, it has yeah. a very weird can feel. Um, when you drink like, it, this is it's like very a solid bubbly. Can. Yeah, this is solid. There's nothing going on. Um, cool. So, so overall... Okay. I'd give this. I mean, six and nine. It's not a, the most complex beer we've had. <sighs> yeah, it's tricky. But it's you know, it's, it's mean... definitely on the good scale of beer. So like, I've said in the past, my good scale of beer is uh, six and above, six to yeah. nine. 
Oh, our scale, or your scale, is a little stricter than some of the other scales. Yeah. There's another beer, the Narragansett, which has a 7 um, out of 10 on Beer Advocate. Okay. And I would say this is better than that beer. But I don't know that this would be considered an 8 beer or anything above a 7. So like a 7 and a half? Yeah, but... Oh, well, you gotta remember. It's my better scale than the is on other. 1 to 9. Right? Exactly. So... Yeah, the other scales are not necessarily the best sometimes. Okay. So, definitely good. Definitely at least a 7. Alright. Uh, as far as drinkability and refreshing. Let's put it this way. You can just keep pounding these back. Yeah. Genesee Beer. That's literally the name of it. For uh, the camera that's above the screen, Genesee Beer. And for the live stream, Genesee Beer. We also have a historical fact um, about Genesee beer that most people don't know. Um, my friend Scott went to Geneseo College and he told me interesting fact. And basically, he said, I asked him what his favorite Genesee beer was out of curiosity and to kind of get an idea of what to buy. Mm -hmm. And he told me it was a common misconception and that Geneseo is not in Genesee County. It's in Livingston County, so he has no knowledge of what goes on in Genesee County or its beer. And I don't think most people realize that. Geneseo College, totally unrelated to Genesee County. So. That's weird. College kids have no clue about this beer. It's just an upstate beer. It's an upstate beer. But it's named after the college? I'm from Long Island, so like I see Genesee, it's like, oh, that must be a college beer. And it's not. It's not. Which is... Mind blowing. News to you. I always thought it was. <laughs> from, from what, what from we call, What are we calling this now? Oh. From the beer cooler. Yeah. To you. Genesee beer is not from Genesee. Nope. What's that? We're trying to get two toddlers to sleep, and apparently they're still awake. <laughs>